hey welcome back to my youtube channel my name is michelle if you're new here i'm a full-time reseller today i'm meeting up for breakfast and then to sourcing with two friends one of them's getting in the car right now <laughs> this intro is so late we're late okay bye <laughs> So Alexa just took her shoes off because they were cold. They were they were cold. We are sorting through our carts already um, because I got a lot. Hi. So yeah. Zadig and Voltaire. Yes, shaking it. Okay, so my phone is on 10%, but I'm still looking. I'm in uh, the clearance section. Oh, sorry. Um, so we'll see. Maybe I'll do a haul later. Now, just show me two of your favorite things. All right. What? We got this little theory. Yay. And then Reformation. I just got home and uh, my phone died while we were at the store, but I got a good a good amount of things. Um, I'm probably gonna go through them later on today or tomorrow, but it's Saturday night now. It's like six something o'clock, and so I'm pretty hungry. I'm getting ready to maybe go eat or order food, and maybe I'll show you guys what I got in a separate video. Maybe I'll do it in this video. I'm not sure. I bet you can see the ring light in my eyeglasses right now because I can see them here, but I wanted to show you like my top five favorite things from the vlog that I got with um, Alexa and Lindsay. So I'm going to show you now. I hope this angle's not too strange. I'm actually, this is like a few days later now, and I'm headed to New Jersey um, for a few days. So yeah. Anyway, I'm going to get I'm just gonna just gonna show you okay this is obviously a graphic tee um the nascar t-shirts are like really trending right now and this guy is not a nascar driver Ooh, it's really washed out right now um <laughs> he's actually a producer and a dj after i did some research so this is actually just a modern t-shirt it's not from the 90s or y2k or anything like this is you know fairly recent um it's a 2xl and I don't know, I just thought the style was cool. And yeah, I know nothing about NASCAR and I don't know anything about this DJ. I just, I just like the graphic. So that was a cool find. This one is one of my favorite brands. I love, this is, hold on, a piece apart. This is a size six and it's kind of just like a tunic dress. Um, it's like a mini dress. I think it has pockets too, which is really nice. A lot of the stuff that I got on this particular day, I did pay up for. So, um, and I, I should also say that we weren't at a regular thrift store. We were at like a buy, sell, trade. It wasn't like the Goodwill or Salvation Army. So anyway, um, yeah, this is one of my faves. So that one should actually probably go for around, I want to say like mm, in the realm of like 80 to 120, hopefully. So I know that's kind of a wide range, but I haven't checked comps on it yet. This next piece is actually for me and I love it and I'm probably going to sell it at some point. It's just, I really love it right now. So I'm going to just wear it around. It's this vintage chunky knit sweater. How cute is that? Let me uh, get you a close up of these buttons. I'm just, I'm a huge fan. <laughs> and it's got some front pockets here. Um, let me try it on and you'll see. I dig it, you know? The sleeves are really puffy. So even though this is like, like kind of like an itchy wool, I, it literally does not even touch my arm. My arm is just like floating on the inside. So yeah, I love this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hang out with it for a bit. This item I bought knowing full well that it is damaged. Now, um, hear me out here. It's a brand I've never found before and I want to try to fix it. And if I can't fix it or stain treat it or anything, I'm going to sell it as is and see how much it sells for. 
Uh, the brand is Love Shack Fancy. And this is my first time finding Love Shack Fancy in the wild. It's something I've seen on Instagram a ton and that I'm sort of familiar with their brand. Um, they sell lots of pretty dresses and this is sort of like a bell sleeve silk dress. Now uh, the waist here has like, I, I don't know if you can see it yet, but the waist has like this frayed edge and everything. But the stain where it crisscrosses on the on the bust, I think, I don't know if you can kind of see that, but um, there's also some little tears here from where the, the stain, it almost is like someone dropped, like, I don't know, like maybe food or something on it. And then they were trying to like maybe wash it out and then it ripped or it tore. This is more or less an experimental piece. And um, I paid more than I normally would for something that's damaged, but I also, saw comps on a couple of damaged items from this brand and they were still selling for like 60 so we'll see and then the last but not least probably my favorite find from this whole trip is this zadig and voltaire teddy coat this is the let me show you the label that's the brand how cool is this this is just like hello i'm extra i'm here for it you know what i mean i just this is so good uh, comps on this jacket are around 200. I only saw like two, two comparable sales on Poshmark for it though. So we'll see how much it actually sells for. And there's one listed right now, but in a different color. Uh, this one does not have the size or anything, but I would, or does it have the size? Hold on. On the care tag, it says Kana, there's a style number and then it says M. So I'm pretty sure this is a medium and it's just fitting a little bit small. Really, really stoked about this one. And I did pay up for it as well, but after checking comps i'm more than happy to do that <laughs> and that's that <laughs> thank you so much for watching this vlog um let me know down in the comments which one of those pieces was your favorite or if you're not a fan of any of them <laughs> or if you've ever found any of those brands before um i would be really stoked to know because those were all first for me well except for a piece apart but uh, the Zadig and Voltaire, Love Shack Fancy, those are first for me and uh, I was really excited to find those. But before you go, like, subscribe, comment, thumbs up, and ring the bell so that you don't miss out on any more videos. Okay, see you in the next one. Bye!